In our Security Pro Labs, we simulate several of the tools that you would use in, in the real world as a security admin. As an example, this lab, we simulate a security evaluator tool, which is similar to security validation tools that I've used in the real world. In this case, we'll take a look at the machines that are on the network and we'll go to workstations and we have the machines that are available on the network. We're going to scan Office 2, so we'll select that one and then we'll tell it to go ahead and scan that. And as you can see, it shows you vulnerabilities that are showing up on that machine. And, and the idea is that you scan these vulnerabilities and then you go to that machine and you fix those vulnerabilities and then you can scan again and make sure that, that the computer is more secure. So let's go ahead and take a look at uh, that Office 2 computer. We'll try and fix these two vulnerabilities here. The first one says, hey, administrator account needs to be renamed. Um, if it, it, you wouldn't want to leave the same administrator account on there because that's an easy way for people to know that there's an account there. And it also says we have too many administrators on this account. More than two administrators are found on this computer. So let's take a look at the navigation. Um, if I click on the breadcrumbs up here, I can go to the office itself and you'll see that outside of the operating system, we have the actual computer and the monitors and the things that you can work with. If we go to floor one, it takes you out a level and you can see that we have the entire office view where you can see all the computers that are in the office. And we can even go out one more level out to the full campus view where you can see, okay, we have building A and we have building B and we have different floors and levels on each of those. We're working on floor one, so we'll go back to there and we'll choose office two. And that brings us to the machine that we ran the vulnerability scan on. And this is the one that we need to do our remediation on. So we'll go ahead and select uh, computer management. Under local users and groups, we can look at users. Here's the administrator user that it told us needed to be renamed, so let's go ahead and rename that. We'll call it something like X admin. That's something that somebody probably wouldn't guess that the administrator's name is X admin instead of administrator. And one of the other vulnerabilities that told us that this computer had was that the administrator's group has too many users, so we'll go to the administrator's group. You'll notice there's X admin, there's Mary and there's Susan. Too many, they want no more than two. So let's go ahead and remove Susan and we'll click OK. And we'll navigate back to the IT admin computer where we were running our vulnerability scan. And we'll rerun the vulnerability scan against Office 2 to see how we did. And you'll notice that the two critical issues are now gone and now we've got some issues that are not as critical but we probably should fix also. But the two that we were looking at, the administrator account rename and the too many administrators issue has been fixed. So just like in the real world, you can run the vulnerability scan, see the vulnerabilities, try to remediate or patch the vulnerabilities, rerun the scan to see how you've done and see how the computer's security is improving. So those are the kind of tasks you would do in the real world and we simulate those in our labs in Security Pro.